They're not even old enough to drive, but some fifth and sixth graders in West Carrollton are flying. Yeah, and this comes after the district received a grant. Students are now learning how to pilot drones. Only on two. Tutors reporter Kelly King shows us how the skills they are learning now are propelling them into the future. The Drone Club at West Carrollton Intermediate started in January. Twice a week, they meet to perfect their piloting skills while gearing up for their first competition. There's a lot of buzz in West Carrollton. I mean, how many people can say I'm part of a drone club at my school? Well, roughly 30 West Carrollton Intermediate students can, like sixth grader Illy Andrews. I have a thing for technology. I tend to get on as much technology I can. You can ask my grandmother that. She can confirm. That confirmation also evident here. Students are not only flying drones, they're programming them too. Michael Schuster is one of the sixth graders in the pilot seat. We program the drones using these block things for things like takeoff, land. They're getting ready for their first competition, learning how to maneuver through obstacles. You have to control ping pong balls with air. You have to go through hoops. There's a curtain, and the curtain, someone else has to guide you while you're on the other side and can't see what's going on. Sixth grade STEM teacher and drone club coach Don Kinser is helping them navigate. It's great to see the wonder in their eyes. They, you know, they, they're so into it. The club took off in January after getting a grant. We were awarded three drones and all of the competition field that you can see behind me. And then my school was gracious enough to also um, contribute 10 more drones. With technology literally at their fingertips, they're on the forefront of innovation with this generation flying into the future. I'm really good at controlling drones. I'm, I just think it's fun. Their competition will take place Saturday at the Greene County Career Center. Kelly King, 2 News.